Jonathan Lee Rich is here outside the Montgomery County Courthouse. It is Friday, August 12th, 2016. After four days of testimony by prosecution witnesses in the Kathleen Kane uh, contempt and perjury trial, the prosecution rested. At that point, the jurors, uh, the judge uh, excused the jurors to go into the chambers and the defense presented a motion that they filed with the court about, uh, um, behind me actually, that's um, Douglas Goldblum or uh, Rosenblum and the actual attorneys. Actually, we're gonna go check this out. I'm gonna go check this out myself. Let's see what's going on here. Have a great weekend. Have a great weekend. Wishing them a happy and great weekend. All right. So basically, uh, actually, uh, Kathleen Kane's uh, family members are coming yeah, outside the court. Right now, but she's right behind. Basically, the defense rested. They didn't provide. Uh, they didn't present any witnesses whatsoever. And um, we'll see what we get here. They presented a weak case. You're innocent, Kathleen Kane. You're innocent. I had to show my opinion and my support for Kathleen Kane and a criminal child. They didn't put on a. Uh, they didn't uh, present any witnesses for the defense. So now, on the court has been adjourned for the day over the weekend, and um, on Monday there will be closing. Uh, speeches by both uh, counsel and um, the prosecution and then it will go to the jury um, me personally I've never seen a high-profile case where a defense hasn't presented any witnesses whatsoever so that just shows how weak the case is so uh, there we go have a great day be here Monday <laughs>